Hey Drone Nerds, Matt here with two new products from Anzu Robotics. Now, I'm really excited about these. Let me show you all about them. Anzu Robotics is an American-owned company headquartered out of Austin, Texas, and is operated within the United States. Now, they're offering incredible technology that prioritizes cybersecurity for enterprise drone users. They pride themselves on being a company manufacturing drones that are safe, secure, and dependable, pledging transparency and having a customer-focused business model. So what I have with me today is the Raptor Series drones. Now, there's two variations with many enterprise applications. Both feature up to 45 minutes of flight time, an operating range of 9 miles, and a max wind speed resistance of 27 miles per hour. Now, both these drones in the Raptor series have operating temps from 14 to 104 degrees Fahrenheit. This is the Raptor, and this is the Raptor T. Now, there is no geofencing for these drones. Anzu is giving power to the pilots because they believe it is up to the pilots to know and adhere to airspace regulations. Now, both of these drones have omnidirectional obstacle avoidance. Also, both are powered by the Air Control app from Aloft. So let's talk about this Air Control app from Aloft. It's hosted on US-based secure servers. It has SOC 2 Type 2 certification for security. It offers encrypted live streaming, also weather details for pilots, flight telemetry playback, pilot and fleet management options, and airspace planning. Another cool feature is automatic data tagging for maintenance, pilot certification exploration, or when a new video stream has started within your team. You can track missions and flights from various teams inside your organization. There's also pre and post flight checks, offering customizable checklists according to your company's SOPs. So let's first talk about the Raptor. The Raptor is going to be your purpose-built mapping drone. Weighing in about 2.01 pounds, it has a 20 megapixel, 4 3rd CMOS wide camera with a mechanical shutter to prevent blurring during mapping, as well as a 12 megapixel, half inch CMOS telecamera. It has 56 times hybrid zoom, split screen zoom display, as well as low light mode for improved vision. If you're looking for a drone for mapping or to do waypoint missions, the Raptor is going to be your solution. So now let's move on to the Raptor T. The Raptor T is going to be your thermal solution for inspections and for first responders. It weighs in about 2.02 pounds. It features a 48 megapixel half inch CMOS sensor wide camera, thermal capabilities, and a 12 megapixel half inch CMOS sensor telecamera with 56 times hybrid zoom. The Raptor T has multiple color palettes for thermal operations and can do waypoint missions as well, making this a perfect drone for inspections or first responders. Now let's move over to the Raptor RC. The Raptor RC is a dual band RC transmission remote controller. It features a 5.5 inch touchscreen display with operating time of up to three hours. It also features a mini HDMI port out for video sharing. Now let's move on to the accessories that you can get for both of these models. First, you're gonna have the loudspeaker. The loudspeaker attachment is perfect for first responder applications with a reading of 110 decibels at 3.2 feet and a broadcast distance of 328 feet at 70 decibels. Now, moving on to the RTK hat attachment. This is what gets you that centimeter level accuracy when mapping or doing waypoint missions. If you would like to learn more about how the Anza Robotics Raptor series can integrate into your workflow, click the link in the description. If you have any questions, you can put those down in the comment section. And don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. My name is Matt. Happy flying.